Yo, what's up, guys? Uh, designing logos got much more easier with the um, evolving so many PNG websites I'll have. The, uh, most of the times, you have already designed stocks, okay? We have stocks that have already been designed. So, we don't need to like just work on it a bit, okay? So, I'll actually be using one of these stuff today to show you guys how to design a medical logo for like a medical uh, firm, okay? That they actually do in medical equipment all right so that's it for this um tutorial so this is what i'll be using all right i got this thing from similar png all right so that's the that's the that's the link there i highlighted it okay so using this for a medical logo right now the first thing i'll be doing is to download it so just click that you're not a robot click on download Okay, so it's downloading. So when it downloads, I will just come here to my Photoshop Control N. When I do Control N, I'll make it three thousand by three thousand. I'll make it white. So when I make it white, I open up my download and come here and i'll drag the download what i just downloaded okay i'll down drag it here but when i drag it here i'll make sure it is centralized okay so this is centralized so the next thing i'll be doing is um typing the brand name okay let's see dom make it sound like 100 because this text is usually just a uh, small text. Okay, so when this is it, Jesse Dom uh, Clinical Materials Vendor. Okay, so I think this is quite easy all right quite easy simple straightforward to the point all right and i think everybody's happy okay so being like this i think we are done with the white version of our graphic design so simple that the next one is the one that would, would probably trigger us some creativity all right so let's go to Control n again when you go to Control n it should be three thousand by three thousand or make it black so when you make it black you create so when you create the next thing you drag this up when you drag this up to this side okay when you drag this up to this side make sure it is centralized then drop it then drag the name to let's pop it on to z What's popping? Mommy, I like you. What's popping? No. Oh, it's good. What's popping? So come to your T, then change it to white. Alright? Change it to white. Just drop it. Don't worry. When you finish, you arrange. This one to drag it. When you drag, you drop. Next, you open. Put it white. Okay? So next, guys, uh, we're trying to align these this letters. All right, so. Okay, so next, we'll be trying to put up that golden color. So we just go to gradient overlay. Why go to gradient overlay? I previously did a design that uh, I use this gradient stuff, okay? But. I think let me be rearranging the gradient so that my designs are not looking like the same thing. Okay, okay. You come to Jesse Dom, you go to FX, you go to gradient overlay. And I think everything is fine. Go to materials vendor, go to FX, go to gradient overlay. I just want like just shift out some stuff, right? Shift out some stuff. Okay. 
okay so i feel this is it i feel this is cool safe okay then let's see um let's go to all right oh let's just save it like that right just save it yes everything is cool right so that's it and that's our graphic design all right, D2. This is a uh, gold. This is the color, right? This was the previous one I did. This is the gold color, right? So very simple. It's a trick on how to do design very cute logos ASAP, all right? So see you guys in the next tutorial. Bye for now.